day, the average person will eat over 5,000 calories. Challenge accepted. <laughs> that is three times the recommended amount. So what are you going to do to shed all those calories? Well, Zarek Knight, Katie Brantley from Shred415, they have some advice. I came sneaking out here trying to fake some kind of muscle <laughs> pull. It was uh, impressive. But it is something. I mean, behind you, I made the crack that, hey, you went to my desk. Uh, <laughs> this is stuff that we see all over the place. We pick, we eat the, the M&Ms with the peanut film, and we just eat and eat and eat. And yeah. you're going to help us out. Offices, I mean, it's everywhere. What we like to, you know, really promote within our healthy, active lifestyle is that we mm -hmm. like to in moderation, right? And so we are here to kind of show you guys some awesome workouts and fitness ideas And you're going to gonna get right that. to work. So I'm going to jump in it. He's going to get to work. And these, these are the exercises where we can actually burn 5,000 calories, right? We'll work on that. Okay. <laughs> so again, we're from Shred 415, and the average calorie burn you can get is anywhere from 500 to 1,200 calories, all fitness levels. When you start to incorporate high-intensity interval training, we have treadmills, so you get to burn calories on that. Right. And the key is that you just got to do it, right? It doesn't take forever to do it. You don't have to be on the treadmill for seven days. You know, you can <laughs> exactly. work out in intervals, right? Exactly. So what are some of the yeah. workouts that you guys, some of the high-intense exercises that you guys recommend? Awesome. So we do have, um, like we talked about, treadmills where people will spend mm -hmm. 30 minutes total. And then we also have a floor where we're going to work upper, lower, core, and cardio. So we're going to mm -hmm. demonstrate some movements if you're ready. I'm ready. Okay. So awesome. Derek's going to do some me. upper body. He's going to do some biceps into shoulder press. So really working multiple muscle groups. Now, people know. at home who haven't done this before, talk about his technique. Yeah. So his feet are hip width apart. Knees are soft. Core is engaged. Elbows tight. Elbows in. Mm -hmm. And then with that press, really focusing on those shoulder movements. Options for people. He's got a great haircut, too. <laughs> it's amazing. Yes, I think he, he did it just for this. <laughs> um, but options for people are always lighter weights, heavier weights. Every exercise we do at Shred, it's a minute long. Okay. So that way people can do as many reps as they need to in that minute. Um, and we have a variety of different weight and options it changes for people. It up. Are you yeah. feeling the burn yet? Oh, yeah. It feels good. Oh, don't lie. There's more to go. There's more to go. There's more. Okay, so then if we were to take it to lower body, mm -hmm. he's going to do a squat, feet hip width apart, sitting back into it, stepping back, lunge. And this is really going to work all of those lower okay. muscle groups, your quads, your glutes, your hamstrings, keeping his chest up. Keys for the lunge that we should watch for. So making sure you step back enough. So if he holds that, you'll see that he just drops his hip down, knee bent 90 degrees. That heel is up and feeling the push from your front leg. Does his knee touch the floor? It should just be a couple inches away from it. Just a couple yeah, it's a great of inches. question. And then uh, one more one more workout here before we have to send it back in. <laughs> Which one All right, we got? so let's work some core. Some oblique. Go ahead and he's going to take it down to the deck and he's going to take it into some bicep curls, elbow to knee, working the obliques. And that. again, when you come into Shred, we have all different options. So another option would be to bring your feet flat on the ground and just do alternating crunches just well, like that. Well, and that's a good thing. If you have questions, there's plenty of people around that can help you. And obviously, uh, Shred 415 is one of those places where you can get the information and then the guidance you need to achieve those goals so we can indulge every now and then. But like you said, in moderation. Are you feeling it? Yes. You did wonderful, man. Look at that. Ah, <laughs> yes. Guys, now we can enjoy. Uh, that's exactly what you. Yes, now you can have a uh, half a cookie. It's a good reminder this time of year, Christmas. Christmas is more than just the latest electronic gadget or the fancy dinner, right? Sometimes it's about letting the kids know mm -hmm. that they are not forgotten this Christmas.